Uh, so, yeah. Oops. Well then, welcome. Boop. We are right here. Why are we back here? I didn't see a skeleton here. Ah, uh, you'll have to put you'll have to put him in, yeah, right up there. This was the place with the terrible floor. The floor killed me before. Hey, cleric. 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 Hey, cleric. cleric. Apparently, Wedge is still passing through the ether. I'm guessing. God damn God it! Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm talking to I'm talking to Zarathos anyway. Well, that's what I mean. This is characters not on here, so he's still passing through the the eternal void. Fair, because I smacked him upside the head. He's also got to come back and read some stuff. Oh no! Or what is this? This isn't where we're supposed to be. You're supposed to read these stuff. Yeah, sorry, one sec, it didn't send because meh meh thank you, Roll20, for having weird fucking ads. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, so Wedge is back with us now? Wait, what? So I say, I say... Yeah, what? Uh, eh. Axel, so, wait, why, why, why you do this? <laughs> hmm, I wonder... Are, are you doing this just to fuck with me? If you are, that's not nice. No, man, it has nothing to do with the fact that your uh, inscribed ruin sigils from before only ever worked on you and Sarah show. Oh. Oh. That's the difference between having the key, oh. by the way. That's what the key is for, is to keep everybody together. You're just lucky they all showed up in the same spot. I just love nobody. I love that nobody is like, ah, this and Xerathos told you he's like, keep the key on you. Okay, and wait a minute, what was Florence supposed to do? Florence is not. Okay. <laughs> to be to be no, fair, the cleric is suffering from dead brain right now. <laughs> Well, he was resurrected into a dead body, so... Okay. This is fine. Florence, this is fine. We've got this. Uh, we just have to be careful of this floor. And then we can fucking run. You know? So... Is, there's nothing on the floor in front of us, right? Nothing so far. We're not dealing with Gunther, or what that thing was. It's still has. Yeah, it's probably a good thing. Let's 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 yeah. let's go. Please, I picked up the fact that that was probably not Gunther, given my reaction. Yeah, I thought so. I was hesitant before stepping onto the floor, but then I stepped onto the floor. What happened? I think you know the answer to that. What do I have to roll? You can do either perception or, I think, investigation. They are the same. Does it matter? I'll pick perception. Huh. 
Okay, 19 plus 4 is 23. 23, you say? 23, I say. Mm. All right, everything seems to be pretty normal down here. Okay, well, it's fine. Florence, come on. Yeah, the, the famous last words. Famous last words you said. Everything's fine. Uh, Florence looks down those stairs and before she walks down them, like gets to the edge and looks down them. And deeply sighs. Please hope the famous words do not repeat history. You're fine. Oh, did you call me famous? Oh, did you call me famous? No, 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 no. I said famous last words. Because we keep in mind, this is also the place where I am. Um... He died here earlier. You're fine. Florence looks at Carly like, yeah, that is great news to hear. You're going to be fine. Yeah, you're going to be fine. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Who knows what trouble the boys are getting up to? I mean, oh, you know, we're going to strip clubs, we're drinking alcohol, we're throwing parties. <laughs> what do you think we're doing? Oh man, I'm gonna have to download this stream. Damn it, I forgot to record it. Yay! Oh well. It is. If you are using investigation, you can use your magical advantage. Okay, yeah, I am. A 16. Uh. Suddenly in front of Florence, appearing only to her and the audience. Seems to quack. 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 What are you looking at, Lauren? There's nothing there. Carly sighs. It's not real, though. I wave my hand around where she's where she's uh um looking. Well, D20. See, not real. Me? Yeah. Seven. Take seven damage. Okay, I'm at nine hit points. I'm almost dead. And Lauren's like, and so it's not real, huh? <laughs> I fucking hate this place. Let's just go. If we walk fast, nobody will bother us. I go over to the door. Actually, before I do that, I'm going. Whoa, shh, shh, shh. computer, Jesus. Um, I am going to cast cure wounds on myself at second level. A wise choice. Uh, I need two d eights. Okay. Um, eight. 
I rolled an 8 and a 6. That's pretty good. Um, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, plus 5 is 19, so I've healed myself for 19 points. That is pretty good. Okay. So then, I try to open the door. Okay. Does it open? Yes. yes. Awesome. Florence, if you make a run for it, nothing will get ya. Quack. Donnie says that might not necessarily be true. And Florence is gonna look back at the uh, dog and Sara and wonder, are they real? Please tell me what the good sense of humor. I don't know, are they real? I know, that's the golden bush and all Are they real with a twin hat 20? Yes! They actually seem 100% real. Wait a minute. You guys are real. Quack. Quack. Yeah, he said we're real. Okay, yeah. Really, uh, really real. Yeah, no, no, no. We've been dealing with some crazy crap, as you can tell. Yeah! I was a cat! Okay, so I'm not losing my mind. I didn't say that. Yeah. Cool whack. God damn it! I do have a mind, Donnie! I cast Minor Illusion to make Donnie have bunny ears. Ah! Cool whack. <laughs> Trying to go down. You got this, babe. <laughs> Twenty-one. Hey, everything looks fine. There, see, told you. Yeah, hopefully. Here. And Florence is just just step from right, you know, red legal straight. Straight. She's just gonna go this way and then down this way. Okay. That was interesting. Gonna an, you don't take trust the lion? I don't trust that straight pathway. She doesn't trust that straight pathway. It's true, it's fair. I don't trust straight things either. Cool whack. Donnie is offended by that. Good. He believes all angles should be viewed as equals. Isosceles, right or acute. All angles matter? All angles matter. Disgusting. All curves matter. I opened the door. Didn't, didn't now, hypothetically. Already... What? Didn't you already open the door? I did. Okay, just no, checking. <laughs> or did you? Or did you? <laughs> at this point, I don't know. At this point, even you can't tell what's real. That's completely fair. Birth is a curse, but distance is a prison. Let's walk down this hallway and walk off the door. So now we're out here. Yeah. Is there anything? Roll perception. Anything in the hallway? Or investigation. Roll perception or investigation. This time I'll go for investigation. Uh, yeah, Ooh, nice. That's my so Kylie thinks the whole floor is covered in lava. <laughs> Am I like standing in lava right now?
But yeah, floor is lava. Donnie and Catharsis are here. I hop up. I hop up onto this thing. And what were you just telling me a moment ago? Oh, I was I was telling you to suck my dick. I do oh. want to note that this right here, while it's not always depicted the best, that's a column. And not like a gap. Okay. Florence is just just gonna wanted to point that out. Florence is gonna recall the previous statement Flor uh, Carly had said to Florence. It's not real. It looks real though. I don't know. What did you tell me when I said that? I glare at Florence and get down off the table thing. After you, your highness. I mean, I mean, Lord is playing the smart ass remark. You the smart ass? Never. Look at the monk all away. So Lord is just gonna tiptoe, kind of tiptoe in front of her. Okay. I'm going right behind you. So, since you did say you were tiptoeing, once you get to about right here, you take. Whoop. Oh, sorry. Nope, not that. There we go. Jeez, still four. Four damage! Oh. Told you! I told you! I told you! I'm gonna see what damaged her. Can I see what damaged her? I mean, to you, it looks like it's the lava. I told you the lava was there. I told you. Okay, can she see what the heck was it that actually damaged her? You can look for it. Yeah. I wish you can't see shit, but what it was. Nope. Although, you do see, like, just a little bit of lava on your toes. Oh, I'm Florence. I'm a wizard. I'm so smart. And it's but what was your famous last words when I backed the heck away from the stairs? Excuse me, darling. I'm still alive, so I don't have last words. Did that duck just walk through? Quack. Donnie said there's no lava. Thank you. You got hurt. And I shove her. I feel like I should almost say, is this another death of Florence being pushed into lava? I'll say I'll say the deck save is probably good enough to get out of a simple show, which is like, hey, don't shove me. <laughs> you said there was lava there. What the fuck? <laughs> It's just how I imagine that conversation going. I would like, I would like to very carefully follow the path that the duck went, but like tiptoeing very carefully. Does it hurt me? No, I mean. No, no. Does it hurt being so beautiful? It does sometimes. Okay. Oh, God. And Florence is gonna fall down. No. Tiptoe in. They continue to tiptoe. Tiptoe through the tulips. La 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 la. Oh, my God. I had to go there. Oh, because she's got to tie the damn key to a damn cell. Wedge is certainly something. I mean, I will not be present. I'm getting a hold of that, Joe. You don't want me to say anything. I'd go right here. They say, shh, there's someone in here. There's someone in here. Yeah. What if we, what if we just fucking book it? Where are we booking it to? Right up those stairs. Right here. 
or here, because I think that'll take us out of here. Okay, are you ready? I am. Why are we whispering? Who? Who said that? Uh, it was just the disembodied voices of the jackass. <laughs> Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I don't know what the purpose of her name is, but I think she's going to be better. Alright, so yeah, I mean, you can make that run if you want to try it. I would like to, first perception, perceive if there is a round. If there is what? There's what? What, what were you trying Sorry, to I ripped, perceive? I ripped my headphones out of my phone, so I lost a, lost my voice for a moment. I want to perceive if there's anything in the room. Ah, okay. I can't fucking read what that says. 17 plus 4 is 21. There does seem to be something in the room. But I can't tell what or where. I mean, it seems to be maybe deeper into the room over this way. Okay. Okay. So, first, what I do is I cast Mage Hand uh, as far away from me as I can. Uh, about here. I cast it right here. And then I sort of Hover it right here. Does anything happen? Nothing. That, not, no. Not, yeah. I cast. I, let, I dis. I dis away. I make away my mage hand, and I cast normal illusion of. I create a basketball that rolls from this side to this side. It rolls this way. Does anything happen? Uh, geez, sorry. Gotta stretch. Oof. Ooh, Nick. Uh, give me a moment. Okay, but nice. Uh, nice. Wait, did I get to the right person? There we go. Thank you. 
question? Yes. Uh, if Corn sends Ursul around the corner to see what the heck is up ahead, why? What the heck would she see? Well, I I cast my basketball first. We want to make sure it doesn't like kill Ursul. You know, most of my points are good points, Florence. No, it's fine. Listen, all of my points are good points. I've never had a bad idea in my life. <laughs> okay, let's not go back to the um, Lord Lava versus what I saw. I've never, ever, in my life, made a bad decision. Uh-huh. Clearly. Ever. Uh-huh. Clearly. Uh-huh. Yeah, I mean, I'm a part. Do we make bad decisions? Yeah. No. How dare you, disembodied voice of Wedge and Florence? <laughs> I never, ever, in my life, made bad decisions. Ever. I am perfect in every way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, color is rise. No, you're blue. Who said blue isn't surprised? <laughs> oh, looking right? Oh. Yeah, see, 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 see. There's a point being made. It, it wasn't by you. If it wasn't by me, then who was it by, Florence? By a disembodied voice. Oh my god, is it the voice of God? Sometimes. Are you there, God? It's me, Carly. <laughs> Who? <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> just imagine that's the answer, though. <laughs> <It's> just... <laughs> that is so fucking awful. I Isn't love it. it. That's, that would be me. It's just like, hey, God, I know it's been a while, but it's me, Bartholomew. Who? Who? <laughs> Oh, I remember you. Three kids. No no intestines? No? Oh, shit. What's up? <laughs> uh, I mean, it's kind of evolved the way all our D&D sessions evolved. You guys run off the rails like crazy? Yeah. We forget something that someone said about two minutes ago. That's the thing, some of these, sometimes it's like, oh yeah, this is like 10 chapters ago, I don't blame you for forgetting, like, the dragon mouth thing. Yeah, no worries. Then it's like, yeah, we needed that key pretty badly. We made, like, this whole part would have been skipped. Yeah, no, Florence didn't say, didn't, did mention to these guys, and they elected to have a wedge, remember to do it. Does, does the basketball do anything? I mean, it's it's rolling there. But oh, suddenly, from out of the darkness up here is somebody to kick the ball. Who? Oh, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? Who is that? Roll a perception oh, check and see. Uh, okay. Nineteen. Oh, that's pretty decent. Not good enough. And eighteen. Looks like uh, looks like a skelly riding a skelly horse with a skelly uh, armor and skelly skelly. Mm. So. Does he see what? I'm gonna go ahead and let him continue playing with the ball, you know, like moving it around for him. And I'm gonna walk a few steps forward. What? Fuck. I'm gonna walk a few steps forward. To right there. Does anything happen? Uh, 
So he went there. It comes up here. It says something like "God." What? God. Are you okay? What does he say? Quack. I think he said die. But I don't have any dice. Yeah, that's fucking rude. Ooh, are my dice made of plastic? Or are they metal? My dice sets. Aww. Okay, well, I don't want to right now, so I'm just kind of just going to step around you here, though. It grabs you by the arm. No! It's the salt! No! I don't want to be much! No! Ah! 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 No means no! No! I fight! <laughs> fight as in fight fight? It, it, uh, it, it opens its maw like wide and you stare down its gullet where there are like rotten teeth inside. Gross! <laughs> Not a dentist? <laughs> I I try to break the grapple. Alright, um, I guess roll. I forget whichever one, because you can roll. Uh, Dex or uh, the acrobatics or athletics. Yep, so. Whereas the grappler has to roll strength to keep you at bay. Or athletics, in short. It's cocked. Ooh. What does he roll? Uh, I can't remember how that works. It would be his strength if he has no. Pickle. No, not that. I remember how a tie works. Uh, oh. I thought it usually favors the aggressor. Uh, let me I'm getting bad touched by a skeleton. <laughs> Any news, Jewel? Wait, isn't it usually the one who has a higher modifier? <coughs> so, at least according to this Reddit, which is probably the best we're going to get, because I was looking up stuff as well, and I didn't really see anything in the player's handbook, player's handbook. At least, it's usually a house rule, but according to these guys, they like to go attacker, then save, then check, then stay tied out of options, but, and which I kind of feel is the way it should be, because we go with the meet it, not beat it for AC. Mm -hmm. And if that's the way for them, then it's got to be the way back there. So meet it, not beat it is the one, so in order... To escape, you should be cool with a 19, since you need to meet it, not beat it. 
awesome. So I escape. Yeah. And I... Fuck, do I get out of his melee range? If you do, you will give him an opportunity of attack. Unless you take... Well, you already took your ap action to escape from the grapple, so... So uh, this is basically my turn? Yeah. Okay. Um, I have nothing else I can do. Anybody else on Team Carly? <laughs> Cool whack. Help me. I'm pretty. <laughs> That's the only thing. That's the, That's only, the only thing. thing. <laughs> it's not a bad reason. But it's just yeah. not the best reason. Think about this. Think about this. <laughs> what are you? Are you? Are you gonna save me? Uh, this is a crazy idea. This is a crazy, wonderful. Idea. <laughs> you just—it uh, opens its mouth again and goes. Oh, okay. What is that? What is that? I'm just going to walk away I can this right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's too much, but it's too good. Okay, I think we broke I think we broke on that motion after that lovely little Oh, that's me. Hashtag might have deserved it. Might? Alright, alright. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, this might actually work. This might actually work. What I'm about to do. Do it, do it, do it. Save me. Sure, sure, sure. I'm getting bit on. I'm getting bit on, and Florence is over in the corner doing math. <laughs> getting <Yeah>. bit on. <laughs> yeah. That's a. That's that's a. Okay. She's getting hit on by a zombie. Man. Yeah. Oh, they just want a nibble. Just a little bit. <laughs> Don't we all? Hey, you want a piece of me? Yeah. Well, here you go. Rips off a piece. <laughs> Okay, so this crazy might work. It may work, it may not work. Um, but, uh, Florence is going to first go towards the song. Towards the zombie, but right before that happens, this is gonna happen. Uh, and the zombie has pretty much. You like? So you're gonna try to do that, huh? Uh, <laughs> yeah, good. Towards him, or don't know. I mean, I'd. Say that's totally fine, and you're doing it from, I assume, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, you can do that. Yeah. Ah, ah. <laughs> oh man. I mean, it works. Here we go. You make such interesting decisions for your DM, for our DM. It just makes it so easy to be dumb.
You're gonna catch me in whatever 15 foot cube you make. No. She she did it correctly not to hit you. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, no, she's not mean like that. Unlike some people. Looks a witch. To be fair, a witch shot around you as well. That's fair. Over you, I guess. And then Horns ends up telling you that's a baby. Killed all the baby Minimix. I just wanted to play with the baby mimics. They're babies. We could have had baby mimic pets. No. I'm not no, doing that not again. Again? Not pet mimic again. No, uh, yeah, oh right, we had one that did that already. <laughs> one was enough. One yeah, that was a fully grown mimic, though. <laughs> they, they eat way too much when they get older. <laughs> yes, <laughs> you, they, you gotta grow out of them. <laughs> Need to keep it. It could just be a cute little baby friend. Speaking of, did you see the message that I sent you? Me? No, Michael. Yeah, oh. yeah, I did now since I came in from vaping. <laughs> anyway, um, does the zombie ever make his on DC? Because he has to make a deck save. Does he now? Hmm. Hmm. Magic zombie knows. <laughs> Super speed zombie. And I forget, if the zombie makes its save, that's uh, full, full good rate. Right? Doesn't do half damage on a save? It's half damage. Okay, that's what I thought. So. Five. Ba -ba -ba. We did five damage. You know, I'm proud of us. I think that went well. You know, everything I say can't be a famous last word. Sure it can. It's just one really long speech of last words. <laughs> yeah, someday Mike, Michael should make a character that only speaks in last words. <laughs> so the zombie just looks kind of like angry. And it goes, Brah! What is he, can I tell what he's saying? I mean, you could try. What do I roll? I don't even know, honestly. Intelligence? <laughs> Is that the plus two intelligence? Is that what that means? I mean, yeah. I think that's it. Not with a ten! Yeah. For some reason, you think he's just screaming assholes. That's so weird. I don't want to be eaten by a zombie screaming assholes, Florence. This is one foul mouth zombie. I wonder if it might have deserved to be undead. <laughs> Does anything deserve to be undead? There's a couple things I can think of. So, that, I think that unless the <laughs> bodies or Danny have anything to do, I think that's the end of Quack. our work. I mean. Help me, Donnie. Donnie says he helps those who help themselves. Fifth. Would you be kindly to go help? Lauren's gonna ask. Thank you. So nicely. Go whack. Tony says his feathers are tied. Please. <laughs> she just like kind of gives him it. And then you just hear Donnie laugh. Quack, 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 quack. Quack, 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 quack. See, I could be mean and throwing you, throwing you instead of having to do it. Go whack. 
Donnie, Donnie says that he will rain down a thousand years of destiny upon you. I think. My duck isn't always good. Uh, alright, he does this. He, he comes up to you, and then he pecks you real hard and gives you one point of damage. Now make a perception. <laughs> now make a perception roll with a plus five. Oh, God. He comes up and does the same tag. <laughs> I mean, Carly. Me? He c yep. Yeah. I'm sorry. A perception roll plus five. Uh, you also take one damage. Ow! Quack. So that was with that was with your plus five. No. That was Oof. 15. Oof. After putting the five to it. E. Um. What did that do? I'm curious. I rolled a twenty-eight. Mine was twenty-eight total. I love how this is a good action. Interesting. Is it? Get another. Go on first. Can I? I'm gonna whip the skeleton upside the head. Wait. Have you read the chat at least? Yes, I did. All right. I'm gonna whap him upside the head. All right. Don't forget the key next time. Quack. And then Donnie walks back over to Catharsis. He said, You're welcome. Thank you. Uh, Donnie's near Florence. Well, he is now. He just walked back. Florence is just like, okay, now, did you have to protect me once again? Quack. You didn't realize I am fragile. I had a character, she only has one HP left. <laughs> Donnie almost oh put god. you down. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what if you say something? I'm a healer! I walk over to Florence. <laughs> and... And I am muttering the entire time about goddamn people who don't tell me they need goddamn healing and I cast cure wounds at first level. And that is 1d8 plus 5. <laughs> Woo! 8 plus 5. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. You get 16. Is that right? I don't think okay. so. Because you said eight. Eight? Plus five. Plus eight five. Thirteen. Thirteen! Yes. Yeah. Yeah. This is what this is just evolved to. You get thirteen hit points. Yes. Yeah. So she's back. You're welcome. Back up to fourteen at least. Was it actually wedged in front of a- where did he go? He looks like he might have went towards the stairs. I go to the stairs. Come on, Florence. Uh, at least I attempted to help. You did help. I mean, you made the ducks peck us almost to death. Okay. It was either- okay. Okay, I'm sorry that the breath did nothing to the zombie. No, he's like, we'll catch up with you. Or you'll catch up with us either way. Something like that. Oh, okay. Be careful. Yeah. Also, Florence, the, the skeleton was wet. Ew. Yeah. That, yeah, that's why I whapped him upside the head. And said, don't forget the key next time. Oh, so, so I may have almost burnt him alive. Or almost. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I was just like, oh, 
I don't know where I feel about this because I've gotten my two uh, two licks in. I think my licks that I missed the earlier time. Why do you want to lick wedge? Da da da. She's into that earthy taste. <laughs> <laughs> That's a kind way to describe it. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> If I were to ever lick them, when I'd have to describe them as earthy, that would be the last time I licked them. <laughs> oh gosh, not literally, not literally. She, she may be a she may be a seal, but she's into that earthy taste. <laughs> oh wow, you guys! She wants to make some mud. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, I really be against it. Just get some alcohol and it would be a little bit more loose. Feels like Wedge is pretty easy to take advantage of when he's drunk. <laughs> it's like, hey, Wedge, just put all your money in here and I'll take your stuff. Oh, God. Anyway. Oh, yeah, Florence Falls. It's like, what do you need it for? Ah, I'm just trying to have some fun. Oh my gosh, no, no, this is, this is just the worst case of what the heck. To be fair, he did eat the soul because it looked delicious, so I mean... Yeah, yeah, yeah. From here on out, he's gonna take some pretty big minuses on any time someone tries to convince him of anything. <laughs> it's just like, what is his uh, intelligence? Yeah, he gets another minus one. He hurt his own intelligence. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Historically makes bad choices. Yeah, I'm seeing this. <laughs> but yes, as you transcend the stairs, you uh, you go up them in such fervor that you suddenly pass an archway and find yourself in a familiar scene. A familiar scene? Where? Is that a, is that a scene of Ursals? <laughs> <laughs> It's not a scene, it's a goddamn Ursa. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we are. But I think if you pay close attention, you'll know where you're at. Yeah, I'm paying close attention. Are we at the beginning again? <clears throat> are we outside? Wait a I hear the quiet. Please tell me we're not at the beginning. Let's start at the very beginning. It's a very good place to start. Oh no, anger! <laughs> ah, ah. Oh, nice. Yeah, please tell me we're not at the beginning. <coughs> yeah, where are we? You might be back at the beginning. What do you mean back at the be- Oh! I haven't scrolled up. Okay. Uh, what the hell? I would like to perception check and see what happened. Uh, 19... 23. Ooh, nice. Uh, it looks like you're in a room with Wedge! Is Wedge actually here? Yeah, his character is just not there. Okay, cool, 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 cool. But Wedge is there. And so is Zarathos, technically. So Wedge and Zarathos are here. I'm gonna consider that progress. Is the skull here? You know, this is the first time you've even asked about him. I know, I was about to say, I was, been, I was about to ask, but I'm like, you know what? Maybe we I'm not gonna ask. No, no, I'm gonna see where this goes. Keep my mouth shut. Is the, is the skull here? Perception <laughs> check? <laughs> Perception check, I guess? Perception check! Uh, 17. I roll so good, you guys. So for Carly, you see it right here. Where? Right here. Oh, cool. Okay, so we got all our important people. Why don't we just uh, try to play? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What about mm -hmm. for Florence? <clears throat> what about for Florence? I did a perception check. Yeah, yeah, you did. Is he really there? 
I mean, for you? Yeah. No. Uh, what the hell? That is not the real skull. What the fuck is going on? Oh, right, put your token on the damn map. Yeah, you're up here with us. Yeah. What the fuck is going on? I hate this place. Yeah, I this place hate this campaign now. <laughs> you what? I officially hate this campaign now. <laughs> How do you think I feel out of character? I love this. You you though. you haven't even gotten to the last stage of the reveal, which will be the best stage. I'm still having a great time. It's gonna be great. I can already guarantee you, it's gonna be great. Is it great? I don't know about that. It's more like great. <laughs> I'm going to hesitantly again step down down here. I don't even know how much health I have. Why do you not know what health you have? Because it was never stated if I was, you know, brought back to full health when I was turned into a zombie or not. Oh yeah. He's got mummy health. Oh, mummy. Yeah. Mummy health. It's called okay. mummy health. Like a regular. No, it's not regular mummy. But still, mummies. It is a mummy, though. The mummy does have a decent health. Well, a regular mummy does. Yeah. I like to hope the heck he is at least decently as mummified health. Yeah, he's alright. Problem is, he wasn't prepared. Well, he was prepared in a good condition for prestigitation, kind of, except for some pieces of him. Cough. Like his lungs. His dick. Oh. <laughs> that too. <laughs> That's gonna be real awkward when you get to the after hours. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's really Both of you guys don't really need a dick in the picture at all. <laughs> so would Wedge like to try to... to see where they're at with his perception? I might as well. What else am I going? This is a mummified problem. <laughs> 17 perception. Ah. You also see a skull. Why is it that only- A skull point? as in, like, Generac skull? Yeah. yeah. Meanwhile, Florence is the only one that doesn't see the skull. Can- can- can I- can I try to grab the skull? Hey, yeah! Yeah, I'm gonna try to grab the skull. Why are you like this? Why are we like this, dude? <laughs> I didn't say we. I just said you. So, so I guess that, you like I this guess approach? a dex. I guess. You just just make a dex roll. Yeah, I guess. You just grab it. Uh, that's that's a nat twenty. Hey, you grabbed it. I'm gonna start talking it. to it. What do you want? Why are you grabbing me up out of the air? Can can we just get to the point here and get to where we have to go? Can you like lead us there? Because we we, we we I don't know where the hell we're at right now. We went up the stairs and now we're back here, which you know probably should not have happened. It probably didn't happen, or maybe it did. Who are you? I'm Wedge. Oh, hey, Wedge. Hey, Hi, Generac. Yeah. Hey, you want to get a drink? You know, a drink would be nice, but we kind of have to get the hell out of here. I think he's asked you out. <laughs> Shut up, don't blow my cover. Hey, I just had a demi -lich ask me out? Hell yeah, fucking score for Wedge. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say that after this, you, me, a bottle of 300 year old Chardonnay from the elves. Hell yeah, that sounds like a great time, buddy. Yep. So I'm gonna continue holding on to him and I'm going to, uh. I'm getting. Roll beat, roll perception. <laughs> Roll perception, baby. Let's do this. I'm down here too. Should I roll something? Yes, if you went down to the floor, yes. 
I mean, well, Florence. I said 13 plus 5 for 18. Gotcha. Uh, does one see anything wrong with this picture of him grabbing probably... Nothing? Yeah. Yeah. And just talking to it like it's as if it's plain as day. I got a 22. What was the actual roll? Uh, 18. Okay. So you don't see this. The wedge does. Fuck is that? Travis! Hey, hey, that's, that's, uh, that's, that's, uh, that's, uh, what's your nest from the other campaign? Shh, you don't know that. That's out of character. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> We've been having these fourth wall break-ins. I mean... <laughs> what is the fourth wall? Oh, you know, that's that thing where you uh, don't talk to yourself, you don't talk to the other person, but instead you're talking to the people who are watching you that they don't know is watching them. From another dimension. I, mean, I, I, I know what the fourth wall is. I'm, I'm a bard. What's a wall? You hear Katharis <laughs> say. I would like to attempt to open the door again. Okay. Hey, you, are you friendly? You just walked right through the uh, cat person and they like explode. Uh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Okay. That's cool. I'm kinda hot. Do it again. So you're gonna try to you're gonna try to open the door you said. Yes. Okay. Roll reflex save. Fuck. Dexterity, sorry, yeah. Shit. Uh, on the top of the stairs. Other, just I think all that alcohol is catching, catching up to me. Oh, you think? Eighteen. <laughs> Eighteen. Uh, you are able to successfully dodge backwards as spikes protrude from the door. Fuck me, Jesus Christ. I mean, if you want to later. I want to remind you, you're covered in cat person right now. I'm covered in fucking cat fur. And Janet like, hey, no cheating, lover boy. <laughs> oh, it's not cheating if I planned on involving you. Yeah, fair. Ooh. Ooh. That just makes it a three way. Oh, which is gosh. okay because there's a girl, so there's a little bit of leeway. <laughs> Still a devil's triangle. <laughs> Christ's uh, sake. So, are the spikes real? I guess you'll have to perception check. <sighs> Deep sigh. Deep sigh and a lot of porn sighing. Eight mean again? They seem pretty real. Alright, well. How do we get out? Where's Janarek? I'm holding no. it. Zathros, that one. Zapdos, where's Zapdos? Behind you. It's me. I'm in him, remember? Right, right, yes. Hi, Zapdos, how do we get through here? I don't remember. It's, uh. Where are we? You know, this tower goes lots of places, damn it. So oh, there's yes. sparks on the door now. Is there hmm. still a door handle? Hmm. It looks to be. This, meanwhile, Florence is getting the weirdest sense of deja vu. Oh, really? Hey, deja vu. At which point, <laughs> uh, Xanax just like, don't you mean Dijon mustard? <laughs> meanwhile, Florence is just like sitting back. Relaxing while what's going on and just cut how high up are the spikes? About chest level. Chest level? 
Is that so? What are you planning? What are you planning? Huh. Huh. <laughs> uh-huh. What are you planning? <laughs> well, I'm gonna back up a few, uh, few feet. And I'm going to run and jump over the spikes and launch myself at the door. Hey! <laughs> this is this is literally not even close to the dumbest idea he's had. <laughs> I know, and one is there. In fact, this is a relatively intelligent plan for him. No, just <laughs> With the little wedge. So yeah, I'm I'm gonna I'm going to uh, run and jump and launch myself at the door. Try to launch myself over the spikes that came out of the floor. And try to force the door open with my uh, body weight. All right. Feels like right. you're gonna need an athletics check for your jump, and then I guess a strength check to pop it open. For my athletics, that is a sixteen to jump over the spikes. Does that does that make it over the spikes? So we'll see after you roll your strength to see how hard you run into them first. What? <laughs> Say that you gotta roll your both rolls, man. You got this. And that is also a sixteen on my strength. Oh goody. Yeah, you jumped over the spikes, you're fine. Yay! And you hit your face on the door and smacked it real hard and took three points of damage. <laughs> but the door didn't open? No. Damn. So, as I, like, I hit my, like, I just, like, to the ground, can I, like, try to push the door open? I'm gonna try the handle. Okay. Let's see if that works. Does it work? Oh man, it worked! <laughs> I'll be a son of a bitch. <laughs> Don't you mean a daughter of a bitch? <laughs> hey, how about you don't judge my gender? Fair, fair. You're right. Can't okay. make assumptions. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but yeah, you open the door. I was gonna get there eventually. Mm-hmm. And I, like, have to wedge up and push him in front of me so he gets out the door. Yay! Uh, he takes another three points of damage as his face smacks into nothing, seemingly, right where the doorway's at. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> I see him, like, big damage. Can I put, push my hand against the door? I mean, you mean against the, the non... Against the nothing? Yeah. What happens when I push my hand against the nothing? I mean, there's something there. What the hell? Might need to take a perception like check. There. <laughs> take a take a nice perception check. I like how during this time, just Lord's taking like a nice little short rest of watching these two go at it. That's a thirteen. Oh, if you want to watch us go at it, come yeah. back later. <laughs> oh wow! It, it seems like nothing's there, but every time you push, you just feel solid. Weird. I'm gonna hold the skull up and be like, "Generac, fix that. There's a wall here." He's like, "Well, if there's a wall here, we can't go through." I have a crowbar. <laughs> Those aren't used to open walls. They're used to open doors. <laughs> Well, we don't know if there's a wall there. I just feel a nothing there. Can I hit it with my crowbar? I mean, I don't see why not. I hit the wall with my crowbar. All right, roll your strength. Okay. Thirteen plus strength, uh, one fourteen. All right, so you hit it and you hear a loud ching, and nothing happens. I hit it again. Go ahead, roll strength again. Rolls a one, crowbar slips out, smacks wedge in the back of the head. That's what I'm hoping. <laughs> it's a three or a one. I think it's a three. 
Uh, you yeah. roll and smack it, and a yeah. hard reverberation goes through your hand. Ow. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. We need to find a different way out. Can I look for a different way out? Sure, investigation or perception would be the way to go. Let's go with investigation. Uh, not with a seven. No. The other way out? Roll my perception to try to find way out. I just sit on the floor. With an 11 plus 5, making that a 16. Uh, nothing so far. Son of a whore! <laughs> Farts has literally been up on the pedestal watching you guys trip balls. <laughs> Are we just really just tripping? Is this real? Can I roll uh, let's, let's, let's be honest. Lord Desmond, why the heck did you grab air? AKA, why did you try to grab the skull? And I'm using that word with <laughs> I'm gonna roll and see if this is real. <laughs> That's a nat 20, my man. There we go. It's been waiting Plus for four. been waiting for one of those. Oh, this is what is essentially Florence's short, uh, short On here has a thing called budge. Budge? Yes. You go to the little dice icon and it brings up the table, and at the bottom, underneath the D100, there's one that says fudge. Oh, I don't know what you could do. Maybe type in like roll B3F. Weird. Weird indeed. One of the things I find when I'm drunk. Oh gosh, it's I love it. Night's Tales are really <gasps> Ooh! Ooh! Guys, 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 guys! I, I grab Wedge's arm, I grab like his wrist or whatever, and I drag him over to the skeleton. To the what? Shh. And then I put his hand on the chest of the skeleton. Say what? Shh. Shh. Oh, no, nope, not there. Ah, there. <laughs> <laughs> I, thought, I thought you meant the center of the room was here. I mean, it was, but it's on the other side of that. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right. I'm but sorry. I basically... Here's the what's going on. Yeah. I take one his arm, and I put it... I put the palm of his hand on the... On the skeleton. Does anything happen? Yes. Indeed it does. What happens? So, I was waiting to see if you would take one more moment to look at it. Shit. But you notice that 
There's something off about this skeleton. The skull seems a little different than what a, you, it would match the rest of the skeleton. So I pull Witch's hand back. It's too late! Ah! <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. What happened then? Roll a d100, everybody. Fuck. Everybody roll? Yeah. Unless someone wants to be made the lead roller. Nope. I'm not taking full responsibility. I love it, though, because that means that whoever rolls worst, I grab that one. I'm just kidding. 20. Uh, five. How do you guys do this? <laughs> I don't know, Axel. Have you seen who I am? What about you, Jewel? Jewel? Hello? Mm -hmm. Roll a d100. I already did. Oh, yeah, there it is. Not no. much better. <laughs> Nobody did. Yeah, really? She did a, she did better than you guys, but not much. Mm. So, uh, I, took, I got to take my short rest while these two were trying to open a door. Wedge and <laughs> up a little bit. So essentially, uh, once you place that on there, now Wedge must make a fortitude save, so a con save. Oh. Sorry, sorry, I fucked that's, up. That's a dirty 20. <laughs> Alright, so he has made the save. It's good for him. He's still alive. Well, undead. But uh, once you put his hand on there, a sudden surge of energy starts to be drawn from Wedge's body. I pull his hand away. Uh, you try and take 1d4 damage in retaliation. No! The energy surges. I'm, yeah. I'm gonna tell Zarathos to do something about this, please. I mean, you try, but find yourself unable to speak or do anything but wet your pants. I'm sorry! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to! Would you like to wet your pants, though? You do have a choice. You know what? You know what? You said it happened, so you know what? Well, I said, I said that was the only option. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you said it was the only option because I have to fucking take it. <laughs> uh, fair. Uh, yeah, and it lights up, and you see the uh, energy flare and shoot into the armored body, which radiates a powerful magical energy around it. Disillusioning the spell for approximately 30 feet surrounding it. Mm -hmm. So, this all now is for everyone. Looks to be a dank and dark chamber with hard rule. What, well, sorry, hard walls and no exits besides a staircase near the center of the room. On the other side of that, here. Is a skeleton dressed in a suit of armor on a throne inscribed with ancient ruins and jewels. And a mace. Although its head seems quite different than the rest of its body for some reason. So you'd think I would have seen that with the nat 20, but I didn't, so... Sorry. But you could totally see why I thought this was Zarathos's body. To be fair, it, it looks different, but not like... I mean, it's a skull. Yeah, a skull's a skull. Can, can I do a perception of what the armor looks like? Yee! Imagine drunk me coming up with that idea. Can I figure out what the what that's is happening in the wedge? That's a net 20 to see what the armor looks like, so a total of 25. So it looks like ancient golden armor inscribed with holy cleric ruins and jewels of the Highest order. Also has a nice insignia on it. So, I also rolled a nat 20 to figure out what was happening to my friend Wedge. 
This is... I think this dice is broken. Because it keeps giving me two 20s in a row. I mean, at least you got them now. I've been waiting the whole time you guys are in this room to hit a 20. Hey, fair. <laughs> Just a nat 20. That's all anyone needed was a random nat 20. And it would all be revealed. But yeah, I rolled a nat 20 on that perception on the armor. And, and uh, the body obviously belongs to Zarathos. To be fair, the head just has something off about it, even with a nat 20. It's just something off. It's You can't quite tell. Can, can I attempt to smash the skull? I mean, you can. I'm going to attempt to smash the skull. All right, first make a goddamn strength check. Strength check. Oh, also, it looks like your friend Wedge is having some something sucked out of him. Uh, that's, that's, that's a dirty 20 on my strength check. Alright, you are strong enough to fight against the electricity that is basically being pulled out of your body and actually make the attack. So now you can make an attack. Uh, I have to switch my page here. Actions. Uh, unarmed strike. I'm going to assume that's what you want me to do, yeah. Well, unless you got something else on hand. I mean, I can try smashing it with the pommel of my short sword. You can try. Well, I technically think that still counts in the same manner. Or as improvised weapon strike. Which I think I'll just take the unarmed strike with a plus three to hit. So, yeah, that's what I'll do. Alrighty. Come on, baby. Does, does a 15 hit the skull? I think you know the answer. Is that is that a no? That's a no. Son of a bitch. To be fair, it's a cold shot. Can I can I pick up on what Wedge is putting down and take my crossbow and shoot the skull? I feel like you can with some dis some problems. Like maybe Wait. possibly hitting some people's in the way there. Wait. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Mage hand. Is the is the skull? Don't give me any ideas. Is the skull zapped it? Z generic. It's you know it's tough to tell because something's going on over there with that exactly. But yeah, it seems like it. By so his generic. laughter. Can I just with mage hand pick him up? You can try. I try. Alright, roll your decks, I guess, first. My decks. You're gonna have to get up on him, which is gonna require some speed and agility. Twelve plus my decks of three, so fifteen. Alright, let's see what he feels like. Ha! Yeah, no. <laughs> I say, Janarak, you really should you really should come to me. And I hold out my arms. Oh no. She's using the classic distraction. Of my boobies. I have to roll to resist this. <laughs> roll, to resist. roll to resist. Hey, I rolled What's a... Cool <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel like that's a, like a 13 or a 14. I feel like he got it. <laughs> I mean, you know, if Carly was more well endowed, it'd probably be different. Whoa, whoa. You can't be <laughs> me. You want to woo me. <laughs> I'd say be careful. She'll choke you with a misc. <laughs> <laughs> At which point, uh, out of nowhere, to your ever loving surprise, you just. Donnie comes out of nowhere and kicks him off the top of the, the skull. Hey, thanks. But it doesn't change anything. Hmm. That so is Wedge. I'm getting shit sucked out of me. Yeah. Get sucked. Hmm. I'm, I'm gonna look at Carly and I'm gonna point at her. This is your fault. I know. I said I was sorry. Did you? I did! I said I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry! Oh, yeah. I like how Florence is just watching this chaos and just... You need to do something to help! 
Ew! Hmm. 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 If anyone is fucking suited to dealing with this kind of stuff, it's you, Miss Resting ZL thing. I'm not a fool. That I'm. I'm Carly, the half elf. That's Florence, the sea elf. Yeah. Racist. She's a wizard. Donnie I'm just goes whack. Hell, right now, this duck is more reliable than you two. You know, that's really fucking rude. You just said you loved me, like, 20 minutes ago. Where is, where is that energy? Where is that I energy? I am energy? getting something sucked out of me, and it does not feel good. So excuse me if I'm a little bipolar right now. Well, I mean, this I mean, this is really, at this rate, this is going to be the only thing that sucked out of you. That do <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I go over here to the stairs, and I want to look and see what's upstairs. Up the stairs, huh? Yeah. I'm helping, trust me. So wait, are you talking the center staircase, or the staircase moving up to that platform? The center staircase. Ah, well that one goes down. Oh, that goes down. I want to see what's downstairs. Yeah, go for it. Perception check? Sure. Oh god, I love how this is what happens when Ford doesn't get involved in this chaos. 21? So it looks to be a staircase. <laughs> going down to another flight of uh, the building. Or the structure of the tower. Or something. But I can't see anything downstairs. I mean, nothing distinct. Like a hallway. Like a ball. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So. Oh shit, what do I do? Florence, what do I do? Now it's Florence, what do I do? Oh. Yeah, you're my friend. You're the intelligence in this group. You're the smart one in the group. And basically, as uh, that happens, uh. Finally, Wedge is able to release his hand as the last of the, the the sucking happens. And he falls to the ground, broken and defeated. Like like he always does at the end. Da -dum -tsh. Great, I'm Yamcha. I mean, you said it. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're a Gavin, but man, I didn't know you were a Yamcha. Well, that's basically what I've been degraded to right now. I mean, half of this is your own doing. I, I did not put my hand on the skeleton. Well, that was the other half that wasn't your doing. <laughs> the steps that led you to become this skeleton, I feel like a lot of that started with you. <laughs> there we go, I'm back. What happened? Chaos. Um, he got sucked dry and then he fell over exhausted just like usual. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That tracks. You, you, you say exhausted, but is Wedge dead again? He wasn't alive. Okay, did he see Okay, is he in a more permanent dead <laughs> Is he dead er? No, he's not dead er than he was before. In fact, he didn't even take any damage. Hmm. Well, that's good. Can I see if Zarathos is still in my head with me? Hey, look who's smart. Ah, damn it, that means I have to roll perception. At least you can look now. See what the heck has happened. With uh, five, she's probably more preoccupied with the, her book. That is a total of a 23 to see if Zarathos is still in my head with me. Alright, we're gonna minus that by five because you're dumb. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I say, well, if that's the case, that's an 18 to see if Zarathos is still in my head. <laughs> it's still a good roll. Uh, I mean, you don't hear anything, and you don't feel the uh, kind of itching pain that you had before. 
Zarathos, you here, buddy? And then you just hear from somewhere like a deep throaty bellow, not from your head though, go, Here's the only place I'm not. Interesting. Did I fuck up bad? Did we hear that? Yeah, I was not that. And, uh, with that, you see the, uh, headless body stand up off of the fucking throne. I grab Wedge and, like, pull him back a little bit. Oh, thank you for doing that, because I, I kind of can't move right now. I'm exhausted. Yeah, he is. I pulled you back! Move your character! This is kind of like, uh, you know, yesterday when I went to go get my blood drawn and uh, i was been fasting for 15 hours because I fucked up, went to bed early, and woke up after I was able to, you know, not be able to eat. Once again, I ha these, these situations you set yourself up for failure. <laughs> not only did I not bleed when they stuck me with the needle, I didn't bleed after they pulled the needle out. And I basically almost blacked out. I, 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 though, I do still feel that I jinxed him, because I told him the story about when I went to get my blood taken last time, I passed out because they blew a vein. I don't know what that means, but I'm not going to look it up, because if I do, I'll either cry or vomit, probably both. Probably. All it means is they ruptured a vein. No! Don't know! And <laughs> It's not that big a deal. You, it happens all the time. When you get bruises, you're rupturing blood vessels. I swear to God, I'll leave the call. I swear to God. All right, all right, all right. I won't get all medical on you. I I don't know why veins are one of the things that gross me out too much. Now I want to show you a really the picture from Body Works. I will swear to God. I swear to God. I, I said want you. to. I didn't say I would. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Anyway. That's the difference yes, between me and Michael. Is Michael does it, I want to do it. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for accommodating my my triggers. Yeah. Hashtag trigger. No sick. Uh. So yes. Uh. That that happened. And, uh, it's interestingly enough, you see that the body, the skeleton that was in the body doesn't seem to be there anymore. In fact, it just seems to be armor floating. Zarathos? Okay. Are you, bud? Yeah, that's a good question to ask. For lack of a better term, and you see a uh, golden crown which had been on the side of the Thing along with his mace lift up and sit on top of nothing just above where the well not just above but above where the neck hole for the armor is. Hmm. I don't know if that seems like Be ye cripple or man. <laughs> Alright now I'm a cripple. Yeah, it's alright. You were crippled before, Wedge. Morally crippled. Uh, if you want, I could make your knees match. <laughs> oh my god. If, if you're a friend, can you fix me? Mm, uh, yeah, we don't do that. Really, if you want to repair an undead body, you want to talk to this guy, and he reaches down and picks up Janorak's skull. Janorak, fix why it's broken. Well. Please. And I bat hmm. my eyelash. Here's the thing. There's nothing really wrong with him. Kind of. He's just tired. He's tired. Oh. Can you fix his broken body? His broken dead body? I mean, what do you mean, fix? Make it, like, sustainable for life again? Uh. I don't do life, I do death. 
Well, you may do death, but can you fix a body so the body is 100% accurate? Well, maybe. Listen. Pretty please. I do that thing where girls, like, put their hands, like, in front of, like, their hips and, like, squeeze their boobs together just a little bit, but it's subtle. Pretty please. Ha! He rolled a 19. Fuck. Ha! <laughs> it's like, I don't see why I should. I've already kind of got what I want. And I mean, now that we have this asshole, we can probably get out of here. Oh, come on. Could you please? I mean, I mean, getting out of here is nice and all, but I'd like to have my original body back. Yeah. I'd appreciate it. That's, that's not broken. Mm. And possibly missing organs. Yeah. Mm. I mean, it'll still be dead, though. But that's easier to deal with. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, a, a dead body is easier to deal with than a broken body that's possibly missing organs. Because I kind of did eat a soul and kind of did burn it in my stomach. Who told you to do that? Thank you. He's a dumbass. Yeah, no, he's. We know he's an idiot. We're not even gonna. Dwarves doesn't even look away from her book. Yeah, we've already kind of been over this. Yeah. <laughs> We've been over this, as well as if you uh, think of shish kebabing me, which I will very much not appreciate. I don't Again. Shish your <laughs> you won't. So, uh, with this, you, uh, here's what's gonna happen, and it's gonna be a fun time, boys and girls. Oh no. Oh no. Because it's time to cut scene. Pretty much. It's about that time to end it. Cut scene, get ready for the next episode. But before we do, uh, Janorax looks over at Xerathos, who looks over at Janorax, even though he has no eyes. And, you know, you know, uh, you know, Janorax gives him this motion with his eyebrows, which is weird, because he doesn't have eyebrows. So then he picks him up. Well, you know, uh, Xerathos is body, I guess, picks up Janorak's head and places it where his head would go. And it starts spinning in a circle. At which point Janorak's like, whoa! 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 <laughs> you know, Florence is just back away from where those two are at because I, I learned my lesson not to hear you do when shit goes wrong. Uh... In any, right. in any case, he looks down and he's like, Are you ready to try to get this done, Janorak? It's like, Yes, yes, Zarathos, I think we can do this together. Are you ready? Yes. Do you want Bardic Inspiration? Oh, yes, please. We love Bardic Inspiration. I said, I say then, I say then. Oh, shit. Uh. Uh, you can do this, you can free us, get us out of this hell. No, I want to make it an actual song. I want to make it as close enough to a copyright strike as I can. It's always the goal. Uh, oh, what's that dirty dancing song? Something the time of my life. Uh, that is what it is. And I owe it all to you. And they get bardic inspiration for ten minutes. All right. At which point he they raise their mighty hands to the ceiling, and a powerful beam of light descends upon Michael, which repairs Wait. his. Well, I mean, if if they want to call him that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I do want to remind you that these two are technically both in control of the dead. Hmm. One being a cleric, the other being a demi lich. Yeah, y'all. Yeah, that's true. They both can control you, can't they? Look. Maybe. I give you part of inspiration. <laughs> but uh, they, they repair wedges damaged unholy undead body to its normal undead unholy state of damage. Awesome! Hey, Zarathos? 
Zarathos, buddy? Yeah, yeah. Can you revive him back into his body so Ooh. he's not a dead body anymore? He's just like an alive body? Well, unfortunately, because somebody, and he looks angrily at Janarak, which is weird because he has no head. We didn't actually meld correctly. The original purpose was to put me back in my living body. Isn't that right, Dejana Ray? Well, that was your original purpose. But instead, he got here first by messing with the portal spell and sat in wait. Hmm. Hmm. Like so a you jerk. Can't. You can't put Well, I'm up. not saying I can't roll a reflex rave. <gasps> Everybody roll uh, a reflex save. 19? Oh, are all of us supposed to? No, uh, technically just the three of you in the center, sorry. Uh, what if even in the center? Then you'll be good. For now. Uh, Alright, my next save is an 18 total. Oh, yes. So Alright, so you two are able to jump out to the back. I'm gonna say, like, jump, he kind of rolled. Oh. Oh, it's so horrible. Whoa! What the fuck? Oh, it's big. Oh, it's sweet. So, uh, basically, the stone ruptures below the ground, and a out comes an amorphous looking thing made of dirt and bodies and really sharp bone. Is is Zath is Zathrak still in the mouth? I mean he was for a moment and then you know how mouths work. Featherfall? I can't featherfall. Which is good until the teeth close. <laughs> oh, it's okay. Yeah. Okay. It's okay. Also, this was not the original plan. I want you to know that. Oh, goody. Somebody Thanks, made. Carly. Somebody made a choice. That uh. Well, maybe. I don't know. Did you do something to pip piss off the mimic? Oh, shit. Let me the fuck up! I do you! Oh, yeah, no. There's a reason why we're on the floor in the bed, smartass. I told you to leave my feet, you dumb shit! Who will eat you? So the fucked up part was, even if you had seen Janarek, Wedge screwed you by messing with the mimic and driving it to chase after you inside the tower. I smack Wedge upside the head when he's beside me. <laughs> see, see, and this is why I think about He's beside you and you're beside yourself. <laughs> With anger. <laughs> yes. Yeah, 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 but I, I think that uh, I think that's a good place to stop it for this week. <laughs> Especially <laughs> when you're <laughs> Yeah, no, keep this in mind.